lot of the fiction that I write is very, it's not nature writing per se, but it, it's very outdoors fiction. I, I don't know that I do it on purpose, but I realized at some point that my characters never go inside. The novel is titled The Bee Loud Glade. It's about a man named Finch who gets laid off from his job as a, a marketer selling artificial plants and gets a new job as a decorative hermit living in the garden of a billionaire who is a kind of mysterious venture capitalist type billionaire who's always coming and going. It was the 1700s, 1800s in England. Um, it was very fashionable for wealthy gentlemen who were talking about how great the outdoors were and how much they loved nature but didn't want to actually get dirty, would hire someone to live in their estate uh, and live outside, whether in a cave or in a hut or, or something, and look really shaggy. They weren't allowed to bathe. They weren't allowed to trim their hair or nails or anything. And they weren't allowed to speak. And usually for a term of seven years, they would be hired to live in the estate. So I've been teaching first year classes in, in different departments around campus for a while. Um, I really like first years, partly because, the, especially in the liberal arts classes, because it's so foundational. And even the students who are going to be filmmakers, are going to be writers, need something to be thinking about and grappling with ideas for the work to be really exciting. And I like being in those classes where they get exposed to those kinds of you know, critical thinking and the kinds of ideas and the kinds of, of approaches to research and to knowledge that, that give them something to grapple with in their creative work. I think having the, the combination of publishing students and writing students in one department, which is, is pretty unusual, if not the only one, as, as far as I know, is a great opportunity. And I don't know that when I was a student in the program, I'm not sure I realized how great that was, but now I know a lot of people who are in publishing who can answer my questions, who I can talk to, who are working in, in the field that I need to know something about. I think the faculty is great, and I think it's, it's diverse in terms of the interest in the kind of writing people do, and the kind of writing that they're supportive of, even if it's not what they're actually writing themselves. I thought it was great that you, know, you could write what you wanted to write, and people were willing to engage with it. <laughs>